Hello everyone and thank you for tuning in. Today we're going to go ahead and talk about how to open an anime store. So uh, the consumer base for these products, it has been increasing in the United States yearly and probably by tenfold within the last five years. The Japanese export doesn't necessarily even target a certain age group that are interested, but actually targets all age groups that seem to be mesmerized and interested and have this sort of fan base. From movies, from anime art, from anime collectibles, to a host of other paraphernalia, anime is definitely trending and uh, definitely worth keeping your eye on in a business aspect as well as anime being something that you are passionate about. Um, retail stores are popping up everywhere. You have a, a lot of online retail stores being done. If you're an ardent anime fan and you are looking to start an anime store, this is probably the best time to actually actualize your dream. The market hasn't been flooded with a thousand people yet that are causing some sort of competition. Of course, it is a competition regardless, but there are a lot of areas that are basically unexplored. Uh, starting an anime store seems easy the way that I'm kind of talking about it right now, but it definitely is more than just dreaming and fantasizing it. Uh, you're going to need to establish this fine line between your personal passion for anime products and a business mind to keep this business something profitable, uh, keep the revenue coming in. So uh, as you already mentioned, easier said than done. This is why I'm here today with you guys to go ahead and uh, talk about some tips that can lead to a successful store. Uh, so you're going to want to be enthusiastic and passionate. This is just two keys to success. Uh, like in almost any other business venture, passion will play a very important role in determining how everything's going to pan out, and in my business in particular. And it definitely needs some level of commitment, enthusiasm for you to successfully succeed in running a store. Anime products and art, they definitely require a lot of knowledge and experience for one to understand these fundamental aspects, as well as you're going to need this knowledge and experience to kind of be able to interact with your customers in a positive way, meeting their demands and, you know, freely interacting. Uh, you should definitely do your own research on your own time if this is something of interest. Research the whole business as a whole. There are uh, different types of anime stores available, so maybe researching different products. What are people interested in at the moment? As well as you contacting some sort of manufacturer who are going to be supplying these things. You know, research your target market and the specific products. Um, when you're doing these things, it's going to leave customers constantly coming back, leaving them engaged in your business and in this market, um, as well as location. So, yes, you have a store. You're not going to be able to just put it anywhere and it leads to success. You're going to go ahead and do your research and strategically choose your location. Location of a store can definitely make or break your business. You're going to want an area that's pretty well trafficked and easy accessible. You know, once you have conducted your actual research on the business itself and established the type of store and products that you want to be offered, you're going to go ahead and have to draft a business plan. These business plans are going to be very, very, very fundamental to your success. It is very important as it will guide you on expenditures and proper fund allocation. Still in the business plan, you need to decide whether you'll be running your store on your own or with the help of assistance. That's going to be a big thing. Are you going to have employees? Are you going to be doing this alone? So that is more of a strategic business plan as well as you're going to have to come up with a marketing plan. So marketing a new store, a lot of individuals think it doesn't have to be done or isn't necessary until the store is actually open, which is not true. Uh, marketing should kind of be thought out beforehand. Spread the word about the anime store. Get people engaged before the store even opens. Get people interested before the store even opens. Word of mouth referrals. Well-designated posters. These postings on social media. These are all things that are beneficial to marketing of your business. The options are like literally unlimited. You got to choose the best advertising plan for yourself. As well as think about what's in your pocket and fund-wise what's going to be the best there. Uh, with a successful business, it's not just going to be this one-time interest that these customers have and that be all that's necessary. You're going to want to go ahead and devise plans to keep your customers constantly glued, 
constantly interested in your business and with a good advertising plan in place, you're going to get people coming into these stores, right? It's up to you to keep these incentives in certain ways to keep these anime enthusiasts yearning for more. Uh, Your source of delivery, it needs to be awesome. You need to keep your customers happy. It's going to be a big thing. Uh, Besides the actual delivery service, like I said, doing research on your own time to create more ways to attract these customers. You need to establish a large client base. And uh, you can do things, for example, that require call to action to keep them interested and engaged. You have a website. You can have multiple postings that require call to action. You can have postings of reasonable discounts within the business uh, from time to time to keep your customers engaged. There are many different things to keep these anime fans happy. And with research on your own time, you can lead to success with this. So this is definitely something that has to be thought out, planned strategically, whether it's the marketing aspect of it, the actual business strategic plan, the product research. These are all things that are going to need to be done, but this is a great market right now for anime businesses. Uh, This would definitely be the time if your eyes have been on this business for a while. This would be the time with all of these mesmerizing fans increasing throughout the United States. So with today, you gained some resources to go ahead and start your anime business. And uh, I thank you guys for watching.